to start Demon Souls. Hopefully there's no more updates. <clears throat> so I played Demon Souls on PS3 back in the day, like around around launch, honestly, and that's kind of what my introduction to the Souls series was. Not so it's actually not Dark Souls one, it was actually Demon Souls. And I would say that this game probably gave me a much harder time in my first playthrough than Dark Souls 1 did. Um, but it's amazing nonetheless, and I'm really excited to hop into this. I don't know where I'm going to put my face at yet. <sighs> I'm guessing HDR is unavailable because I'm on my computer monitor, and my computer monitor probably doesn't support it. Honestly, everything looks fine. I think English English on off the badass intro oh, so iconic It should be low right now, RP. It's like low in my ears too. Is that any better? Or you need more? Okay. I think it was low before RP because there was like really nothing happening yet. So just so you guys know, we have about four hours in character creator coming up pretty soon. So get excited for that. Oh, divine, or uh, yeah, divine dragon. Not divine dragon, dragon lord. What is it called? Is it the dragon lord? I don't remember. So hopefully we don't get trolled by any uh any uh, other streamers or YouTubers here and die a bunch, like get invaded and die a bunch. That'd be awkward. Or actually, it would actually be kind of funny. It'd be good content. Um, is that is that girl or boy? It looks like. Yeah, I am boy. Player's name. Well, of course we're gonna be Castfall. All right, starting class. Wait, actually, hold on a second here. What the fuck? Are they both knights? That's interesting. Oh wait, we want to be we, we want to stand straight up and down. We're not going to hunch over. Whoa. That's fine. Um, soul remains. Serve as bait for the soul starved. Oh, we don't have all like the, the day one bonuses that everybody got. That's kind of um permanent. Mm, I'm thinking we go with the ring was my first thought. Let's just go with the ring. Wait a second. Why are we still hunched over? Good luck, RP. All right, I need a better. Pre Is that Jon Snow? We got Jon Snow up in here right now. 
Let's just see what these look like. I'm just curious. Oh, that's dramatic. Dude, look at those eyes. Look at him. That's kind of terrifying. Did we start from the Jon Snow? Is our base? It's an orc. These look wild. Look how detailed this is. All right. I mean, that's pretty, pretty. I'm not, I'm like pale, but I don't know. Am I that pale? That's, that's more realistic, I think, right? Yeah, we'll go. I like that better. Age. A hundred pounds. That's my weight. Oh, uh, is it the weight of your face? Oh, it is. Okay. I don't know. Give him some, some face girth. All right, you know what? I want. I always get like hung up on this. Let's do the hair first, with the beard that I'm gonna have. Um, oh wait, I didn't click it. Gotta click it. That's a pretty accurate beard. Oh man. Um, um, that's probably close. I have a little bit of red in my beard. A lot of hairstyles. Dude, that is my hair. They put my hair in the game. I wish I had hair like that. A little too bright. Oh, too dark. That's probably better. I guess. We're never we're gonna have a helmet on the whole time anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright. Nose. Trying to compare my nose to this dude's. Maybe like that. Yeah, I think that my nose is more like that. I think two makes the most sense here. There's too many. I'm overwhelmed with noses. Um. Okay, that's just the bridge. That's in or out. That's like height on the face, right? And then width is the width of the nostrils. Yeah. Okay. I think his ears look generally fine, right? Eyes. Yeah, we can do some crazy. Oh, look at that shit. The goat eyes. What the fuck you want goat eyes for? I think we'll stick. I'm going to make this a pretty bland character, I think. Like, just like try to make it look like me. Wait, what? Why didn't it, why why are they not blue? Oh, you can like do some crazy color patterns in your eyes. That's cool. Ah, glow. Whoa. You magical. Oh no. Uh I think spacing we're just going to leave alone. Same with height, and then I don't have very sunken eyes. I don't know. That's fine. Uh, your eyebrows are fine. I feel like your nose is too pointy. I saying my own nose is too pointy.
That's probably more accurate to my face, I think. Um, decals. Is that your scar? Oh, no, it's not. There, this is your scar. Oh, shit. You get, like, some ritual scarring shit going on here. I don't personally have any scars on my face, but I love the anime. The anime scar. We're going to go with that. Uh, and then no tattoos. That's good. Or no, uh, yeah, paint or tattoos. Dude, I think that might be it. Might rock, rock this for the, uh, the OG playthrough. I'm good with that. Um... Save the current creation. I'm I'm like confused here though. Like that's hunchback, right? That's not. Maybe it's, just, it's probably because we have heavy armor on. I think it is. Yeah. But also could be based off of um. Your uh, endurance or whatever. What is it in this game? Yeah, endurance. All right, so I think I'm just gonna do uh, kind of not a quality build. Um, probably like more in the realm of of a strength build, I guess. Um, what are we starting out with here? 12, 12, 14, and he has 14 strength. I like this better actually. We're going to start with Soldier, I think. Instead, I was originally going to start with Knight, but I think we're, we're going to go with Soldier. Um, because Endurance, Strength, and Dex are a little higher, and we have more health. Yeah, I think we're... Alright, I think that's uh, good. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. Legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fisher to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Bure of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The Sixth Saint Astria with her knight, Garl Vinland. And Sage Frake, the visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. That's us. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? I guess you'll find out. Hey, 
It is so crazy seeing this game, like, actually in front of me. Like, I'm able to play it finally. Because, <clears throat> like, I remember playing this back in the day, like, on, on PS3. And just how much better it looks right now. I'm, I'm extremely curious to see how it feels compared to the original. That's not the right button. How do I play video games again? There we go. Oh, no, no, no. We can't be doing that. Hold on a second here. Oh, wait. Is it? Okay, the game's not paused. Um. All right. So there is like a photo mode you can go into also. Uh, that's not it. I don't, I don't want that. Okay, let me see here. Take that off. How are we doing now? Not good. Take those off. How are we doing? All right, you know what? That off. Take that off. All right, that is our fast roll. Okay. Oh my god, don't. Yeah, I've never played a Souls game before, guys. Just so you know. I'm like pressing Final Fantasy 10 buttons now. Can I parry him? Can I do it? Do it! Okay, it does feel different, but like in a good way. Look at this. Right, there's no there's no hopping in, in uh, Demon Souls, if I, remember, if I remember correctly. Do it. What? There it is. Oh. All right, well, that's new. Dude, this is so good. I want to backstab you. Hold on. Let me backstab you. Nope. Oh, we can't see it. God damn it. So I wonder if the if the animation changes based off if you have if you're one handing or two handing. The other question is, are we going to be able to beat the, the Vanguard demon up ahead? I'm a little worried about that. Uh, can you not? Yeah, there, there we go. <laughs> Bitch, get parried. Sword kind of derps out during that. It's okay, though. All right, backstab. Here we go. There, we can see it a lot better there. Um, I don't think there's other stuff around here. All right, let's see if the backstab changes with two hands. It does. Okay. Oh, really? Ooh. Are there leap attacks in this game? I don't remember. I don't think there are. Oh, we have a spear on? Oh, shit. You can be a poker. Big poke. The old stabbo. Take that off. Oh, actually, if we take that off, can we put these on? Yes. All right, here we go. Can we take it down? Oh, there's an item there. Fuck, I'm an idiot. It's fine. A forlorn outpost. I forgot there's another area to go through. Now the game starts for real. Kind of. So this will be no by like no means like 100% playthrough or anything like that. I'm just going to enjoy the game. 
we'll fight all the bosses and whatnot. Um, I th I'm pretty. There's side bosses in this game you can do. I'm like actually not 100% sure how to do all of them because when I beat Demon Souls, I played through Demon Souls twice and like I, I think I did like no side stuff the first time because I had like no idea what the fuck I was doing. And the second playthrough, I may have done some, but like not everything by any means. Like I'm probably gonna have to look up how to like find the weapons I want and whatnot. If I remember, these guys don't drop their armor. No, they don't. Just burn through that healing already. That still hurt me. They aren't dropping grass either, assholes. There we go. We don't need uh, the soldier's lotus on right now. I'm going to try not to waste healing items on Vanguard Demon. Um, unless we get like super close to killing him, then I will. Because similar, like, so like similarly to Bloodborne, so I guess in Bloodborne was actually similarly to Demon Souls. You can like run out of healing items. There's no like S this mechanic where you rest and get them all back. Be a shame if you fell in there. Where'd he go? Is this him? Oh, there he is. No. Just top off. I'm. I think he's through here. No, not yet. Something behind me. No. That was a big miss on your part. Alright, here we go. Oh, he looks so fucking cool. Like, I'm... Uh, I'm gonna die. <clears throat> well, uh, there you go. I guess he's not... I guess we're not gonna get to see, uh... The little surprise that happens after that. This time. <laughs> The Nexus. It's really cool because you can see a lot of themes that came out in this game that they've used later on in the later Souls games. It, I like it. It's like it's like fun to see like where it all came from. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Volataria. Like she was the inspiration for the Firekeeper in three and um whatever her name was in two. Also, look at that. That's that's when you're dead. That's how much health you get. You get half your health. Um, well, we'll get an item that kind of helps with that, though. So, yeah, this is the player hub. Oh, he actually, like, looks around. That's cool. Look at that. Yeah, like, so watching Let's Plays of this and then actually playing it, like, like the Let's Plays are really, really fun to watch, but this it does not do it justice to how good the game feels and looks, like, actually seeing it in front of you. Too, did you? You came for demon souls, or to save this land? 
and be remembered as a hero. <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. And by try one of them, he means that one. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Voluntaria. You came for demon souls? Or to save this land? And be remembered as a hero? Bah, it's all the same. You're just another prisoner of the Nexus. We're welcome here. As long as we keep slashing up demons. <laughs> That's the original crestfallen uh, soldier. I'm Stockpile Thomas. My wife and daughter fell victim to the demons. But I would be worthless in battle. At the very least, I hope to lend my assistance to you brave slayers of demons. I would be happy to lighten your load and look after any excess baggage. Right, because in this game that actually matters. When the scourge came, I abandoned my wife and daughter and fled like a coward. That is fucked up, Thomas. When I came to, I was in this nexus. I haven't dared venture outside these walls since. I wish I could do oh, my bad. All right. Flock to you. Thanks. Blacksmith. Mm, you knew here. Are you here for my services? Oh, he has glasses on. The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. Or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? I don't think he has anything we need to buy right now. Do we have any souls anyway? Oh, we have 186. I can tell you're not going to last long here. Hey, that's not very nice. All right, hold on a second. Let me um go over here. Go. Yeah, that way we don't cover anything up. All right, well, I think, uh, let's talk to the, uh, maiden real quick. Where did she go? Uh, what the hell is she? <laughs> well, all right, first arch den. You actually can't, you know, if I'm thinking of this correctly, you might not be able to interact with her or level up or anything until you kill the first boss. Which is also similar to Bloodborne where you need to get one insight. So you can kind of see where that came from. Big old dragon. I think it's... I forget what its name is in this one. It's not Hellkite. That's from Dark Souls 1. Whoa. What's up, dude? Uh, is there something back here? There is. This is the first area. The Boletarian Palace. Pretty good so far. We got we we went through this the uh, tutorial area, died to the first boss that you don't have to beat, but if you do, you get extra stuff. And now we're uh, in the first actual area of the game, which this looks freaking amazing. Holy crap! I, I'd like to watch a side by side video with the original Demon Souls and, and look at it like look at this one and then like side by side. It would be wild. It's definitely not a no hit run. It's, it's not a no death and no hit run. It's a enjoy the game run. Oh, 
Now, I do remember some things about Demon Souls. Whenever you die as a, a, in human form, so right now we're in soul form. When you die in human form, that changes the world tendency towards black world tendency, which means that things get harder in general and like certain things change about the world. And whenever you kill a boss or successfully aid another player, um, though it goes towards white tendency, which makes things change and makes the game a little easier. That's a really cool like world tendency thing that's like never really explained that well in the original. Um, and there might be something here. I, I don't. I'm assuming it told you about it somewhere. Maybe it's like in a. They're like a. There it is. Tendency. Oh my god. That wasn't very nice. Anyways, tendency. Right now, everything should be like like a uh, neutral. Are you fucking serious? No, thank you. Yo, he like swats him. Look at that. Are you? Oh, okay. Oh shit, big miss. There is no plunge attack in this game. I do remember that. So like, it looks like you can drop down there and you can um, once your world tendency is in the right state. Ours obviously is not right now. Okay. Put on the fire bombs. We'll need the resin in a little bit. Um, we'll put the fire bombs on just in case we need to use them. I'll get it one of these times. Come on. There we go. Burn through some heals. Good. All right, we seem to be careful here. Is there a boulder that rolls down somewhere here? Oh, they have fire bombs. That's what it is. The mail breaker. The dagger. Somewhere here. Is it right here? Oh, I think it is. Wait, wait. Is there a guy? Is it not right here? Okay, it's not. Ow! 
Ow. Yo, look at those fire, uh, like textures or whatever you want to call it. This looks crazy. What's that? What's up? Oh no, he had an item! And he fell through a wall. God damn it. Yo, what up, Cookie? Uh, yeah, you missed Final Fantasy. So, what we did was we finished up Xanarkand, and then uh, went and collected all of Orin's, um... His, uh, spheres he has to collect, except for the one in Besaid, where you have to fight Dark Valfour. And then just did a little, a few other like small side quest things. Yeah. So after stream, I unboxed the uh, the old PS5, and now we're uh, and now we're here, <laughs> playing it. So I'm gonna go for a, a good while longer, I think, tonight. Being that like this is like the game that introduced me to the Souls series. Like I played it back in the day, and um, I'm really, really this is like so fucking good. Like right now, it's amazing. Can we wield the bastard sword? With two hands we can. Alright, so this is going to be the weapon we're going to use till we find the claymore. I wish we could do it, use it with uh, with one hand, but we can't right now, so that's kind of shitty. Uh, but we'll get it after we, can, after we beat the first boss. It does. Um, hopefully the stream looks good with it. Um, I, it's probably not doing it 100% justice, but yeah, it's it's really nice. Really? Okay, we can't wield it with one hand, so that's why that didn't count for anything. <laughs> RP did mention leveling up Shiva, which we're gonna do. Just for you, Cookie. We just didn't do it tonight, because we didn't really do any- Oh, we, we unlocked uh, Anima, too. in grass all right can we do we want to go this way right now there's one of these ways we don't want to go no we don't want to go this way because that's a red eye down there yeah we need shiva to beat the dark aeons i mean we could also use the ojimbo to beat the dark aeons but the shiva would be a lot more interesting of a fight i agree Oh my god. Oh. I'm also looking forward to playing FF16. But I'm it'll probably, you know, I think it's going to be a while before we see it. I think what did they say? Probably not 2021, right? I don't remember. They didn't have any kind of date with it whenever they talked whenever that we uh they released that initial initial trailer, right? So we're probably not going to see it for a while, which I'm fine with. Yeah. I mean, I'm fine with waiting for it. Let him get the game done properly. I don't want another FF15 uh, mishap. So, yeah, RP wants to get the exclusive 16 console if they come out with one. I'm not going to lie. I like the white PS5, but I would I, I pr would have preferred the traditional black PlayStation console more than the white one. But I mean, it's cool. Whatever. Is it going to be exclusive for like six months on PS5? That wouldn't surprise me. Whoa. Oh, he's down there still. All right, we're not going to we're not playing this game. Hold on a second here. I have throwing knives? Oh. 
Oh, you're you're also gonna wait for the uh the Steam version. So if it was just if I wasn't play if I wasn't gonna stream it, I would probably also wait for the Steam version of it. But I don't have like my computer is really good. Um, it's not like a. It's definitely not like uh like state of the art up to date or anything like that. So like it would be a lot for my PlayStation or for my for my PC to uh to play Final Fantasy 16 when it comes out and also stream it. So it's easier to offload that to the console in that case. So that's why I'll probably play it on the uh, PS5. Cuz I only have a single PC set up. If I would do it like a stream PC then, you know, that's different, but I'm not going to do it. That's fair. You you cause you just build a you just build a PC this year, so yeah, it's hard to justify buying a PS5. I agree. I, I understand. Yeah, this old this old rig's been going for a long time. Um I did upgrade the uh I, I upgraded to a solid state drive this year, you know, came out of the, the early two thousands. And uh also got <clears throat> I did get a new graphics card this year too. So not like a new new one, like an old new one, if that makes sense. I got a twenty six or twenty seventy. Um, all right, that's a side quest down there. We need to do that. We just we can like hop over the ledge, right? Yeah. What's up, dude? One second. All right, so now that we got the cling ring, our health can go up to three quarters instead of half when we're dead or in soul form. We're gonna need that for most of the playthrough because you do not want to be in human form because of the tendency uh mechanic. That was a bold leap. A surprise indeed. Well now that you are here, pray thee, fend off these dreglings. Is that all you have to say? That was a bold leap. Well now Why can't you fend off the dreglings? All right. What is this? What is his name? My thanks for your What's your name? I am Ostrava mm. of Boletaria. Ostrava. Accept this as a token of my gratitude. Thank you for the telescope. That's essentially the binoculars of this game. Excuse me, sir. Oh, hey, behind us, Ostrava, buddy, behind you. I got him, don't worry. These backstab and parry animations are so fucking satisfying. That is by far, I think, the greatest improvement of this game so far. I got him. I mean, besides the visual overhaul, obviously. But these are, that's like, like, so the backstab animations and um, parry animations are completely different. And they are very well done. Where do you, where do you go? Where are you? What are you doing, dude? What are you, what, what is over here? Is there a guy, an archer shooting you? Oh god, I missed. I missed. I think if he die, I don't, I, I, he might be able to die here and that could be bad. I don't remember. Now I take my leave. There is something I must do. Yeah, we'll see you in a little bit again. Don't worry. Save your ass again. That looks unpleasant. Bye bye. Oh, they didn't blow up. Bye bye. There we go. You really need to sit down and play Tails RP? Why don't you get some Tails of Vesperia time in right now? 
how you get too distracted while you're playing it. It's an amazing story. So, I mean, I highly recommend it. Boom. Look at that. Upgrade mats. So on the original playthrough that I did of this game, I wore the the black leather armor, so like the ninja armor, and used the katana the whole time to get through the whole game. Um, I don't think we're going to do that this time, but that could be fun. Recreate my original build that probably was not good at all, if I'm being honest. But I got the job done. I didn't exp All right, so we came through this way. Did I miss? I just want to make sure. All right, Ostrava was right there. Okay. I just want to make sure I explore all the paths. We didn't go this way. Oh, he's right there anyway. He's uh, not doing too hot again. Oh God. Where, where is Ostrava at right now? He's fighting somewhere. I hear him yelling. Whoa, whoa. Oh, that was you maybe. I want to parry you. Come here. That was not right. Come on. One more. Try again. Try again. Try again. Oh, it didn't work. Are you fucking kidding me? I lost that Strava. Oh, there he is. Didn't we come from that way? Maybe we don't need to worry about him. Oh my god, that startled me slightly. Do it. Coward. Uh, I'm lost. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Oh my god, that's the number one trend on Twitter right now? That's so fucking weird. Good day to you. Care to look over my wares? Uh, sure. Stolen, but who's telling me? I'm not gonna tell anyone, Mr. Dregling. I would like to see what you have. You have a long sword. A short spear, a light crossbow, some... That, that I already have. Um, is it worth buying stuff right now? I think we're not going to. Brave knight or lowly fodder? Demons snatched their souls regardless of their station, plummeting them all into madness. And those a little, little chest on his back and keys were hunted down. It is the end of Great Boletaria as we know it. But hell, at least the demons don't send us to our deaths in battle. <laughs> Aha. There's this skinny fellow. Clad in the most lavish armor, who's always mumbling. That's about Strava. Some mission. He's another one who's managed to stay sane, like yourself. Probably some pampered little lordling by the looks of his attire. I'd give an arm just for the buttons off his shirt. My God. There's also a popular article trending with 100 about 190,000 ceiling fans being recalled because the blades may spin off. That is, <laughs> what? <laughs> Go ahead. Take your time. I'm not going anywhere. 
Dude, I'd be pissed if I just bought a ceiling fan and the blades flew off while I had, while, while, while I had it on. That was hard to say for some reason. <clears throat> I've been talking for like four hours or five hours now, so I'm starting to like lose my mind. I respect like streamers or like anybody who can sit there and talk for like 8, 10, 11 hours at one time. Amazing. Holy shit, it is 1 a.m. You mean to crack the Red Bull now? I'm like feeling good right now. I'm wide awake. So like, I, I don't think I need it. People play Guitar Hero and read chat. Yeah, I, no, not happening. I can barely talk while playing a video game in the first place. <laughs> oh, wait, we're back here. I don't want to be back here though, because I missed something. And I don't know where it is. Hmm. It wouldn't be hilarious if it was your ceiling fan. That you just bought and installed. I think it's this way. Nope. Oh, it's up there. I, you know, I was, I was like kind of worried that I wouldn't like the controller, but it actually feels really good now that I've been using it for a little while. Oh, uh, come on. Dude, all the haptic feedback. What does that even mean? <laughs> he healed up. What a bitch. Coward. Got a heal and have an archer friend over there. Come on, fight me. Now what? Now what? Ow. Look at that. Did he have something? Can't tell. All right, so if you hit this right here, all these like, uh, are they cannonballs? What are they, rocks? Just rocks? Oh, did it actually hurt me? Well, you're not supposed to get hurt by it. I fucked it up. <laughs> but it killed all these guys right here. Ooh, there's a blue dragon. You see it? Okay, there's something over there that I think we want. Oh yeah, so like that little Astros playground thing I did, the the uh the back buttons would get like tenser, like to follow like what was happening on screen. Yeah, like different resistances. It was really cool. So yeah, that was actually pretty cool. I'd be curious to see what that feels like in a game, because like with Demon Souls, it doesn't really. It's like just nice and smooth. That's what the haptic feedback is. Okay. Okay. Whoa! Why are you moaning at me, bro? Weirdo. Whoa. Okay, so... Oh, should I try it? This could end really badly. We have the shortcut. Though, so it's not that bad. So, underneath... I forget what it is. It's funny because I'm going to do this and I can't remember what I'm going to get. There, the item like right underneath that blue dragon's tail, it's something important. And I can't remember what it is, but there's a way you can get it right now if you're really careful about how you do it. That's uncomfortable. We also could just come back here later and, and do it the easy way. Because you do get a chance to kill Mr. Red up there. Ah! And then Mr. Blue is not till much later, but you can actually deal with that whole tail swipe thing. 
More so than the fire breath. Yeah, we'll come back later. We don't we don't really Oh no, I know what it is. Fuck, we need to go do it. It's the ring, it's the Havel ring of this game. Uh you can't kill the dragon now. He'll just burn you from up there. You have to kill him um, on the bridge later. And that one also, uh you'll see later. Much later in the game, like no, we won't get there for a long time. Can I run a Hey! That wasn't cool. I got it! I got the item! I got the item! Woo! Woo! Get out, get out, get out, get out! Oh my god. I found Repen's... Oh, Repeat's costume. You sold Repeat wrong, I think. What is it, RP? Yeah, we'll, we'll go get the rest of that shit later. That's actually a super clutch pickup. So it raises, it's, it raises your equipment weight limit. So like, you can put more stuff on without fat rolling. Oh, there's like four of them. That's cool. Now, I don't know if we can wear this yet. Oh, we can. We can wear our armor again. Can we wear all of our armor? No. All right. So is that? That's about the same. Okay. Cool. We are no longer a naked man. Now we are mostly well, we're dressed man. Just no helmet. I believe we have a, a scaly friend that shows up here, right? Come on, I hear you roaring. Come on, buddy. Let's get a move on it here. There he is. Ah! You seriously pulled off? Are you fucking kidding me? All right. Don't mind me just trying to cross the bridge. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? All right, there you are. Give me this. Do it. Light him up. Ah! Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. You like how Patty, uh, you pulled out again and wanted to start blasting and stuff. Dude, when you said that, it made me think of the Danny DeVito meme. Like, so I started blasting. think this is the lever we are looking for? Yes. Almost time for the first boss. Fine resin, we'll need that. Oh, fuck. Mm, all right. Oh, hey, how you doing, guys? Whoa, there's a lot of you in here, huh? 
Smash! Oh, oh. Easy with those stabs, buddy. Ow. Just smacks him in the back of the head with a sword. Come on. Interesting. Now, what's the running attack with this? Hold on. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not right now is the best time for that. Oh, just a smack. All right. This is a, a precursor to what we're going to find down below. Old slug man. Can I just get behind you and smack you? Yes, I can. So they're weak to fire. They're like an oily blob. <laughs> so like fire uh, makes them blow up. Not blow up, but like it kills them. I, I dodged that game. I think they dropped that shield that's on the front of them, too. Yeah, essentially a Grimer with a shield. Yes. We're going to fight a Muck with a bunch of Grimers here to uh, continue with that analogy. <laughs> In a second. And that is the first area of the game. And now we're to the first boss. I'm going to see if I can do this the right way. Ah, the phalanx demon. So, whoop. And whoop. This guy's actually really hard if you don't like know this little strat here with the fire. We've breached his armor! I've seen 300. I know what happens when there's a, a person falls in the shield wall. Woo, first boss down. So for the record, failing Steeman's not supposed to be super hard as long as you know the way to fight him like that. Um, that fire looks really fucking nice on that sword. Look at that. It's gone now. All right, so we can level up now once we get back. The lead demon soul. We're not going to burn any souls um, because I don't remember what they do, like what weapons you get from them and whatnot. Um, so the big thing with demon souls if I'm remembering correctly, a lot of the bosses aren't like super hard, but the areas leading up to the bosses are fucking crazy sometimes. Like they're actually really hard. The monumental awaits the above. Oh no, I have to go find him. I, I, this is like the first time you play this game, this little dude's so fucking hard to find. Uh, it shouldn't be hopefully too bad because I kind of know where he's at <laughs> But like if you were blind right now playing this game like a blind playthrough um, It's not very straightforward because it goes gives you the right there, but there's like a little bit more you got to do The monumental will explain the nexus to thee Whoa Uh, you're not gonna let me level up till I talk to him. The monumental. the monumental, the monumental, the monumental. Okay, I'll go talk to him. We're also gonna kill ourselves here in a second once we get up here and talk to this dude. 
because we do not want to go into the next area in um, human form because if we die we'll fuck the tendency up and I don't want to do that uh, I want to keep going up There he is. You can tell because the candle's lit. I I want to say there's items over here somewhere. I could be crazy. That's another path. Oh, right, there's an item. He's speaking to us through his mind. We preserve the fabric of reality. There is a tale I wish to tell you. Once we too a scourge of demons faced. Cutscene. They definitely did away with these in the uh, later the edition of Souls passed. games. Under benevolent rule world was united owing to the soul arts. Until a lust for power caused the awakening of the old one. Across the land seeped a colorless deep fog and the world faced extinction at the hands of the demons. Thanks be we were able to lull the old one back to its slumber. Yet only after the loss of innumerable souls and most of the world, lost, erased by the fog. In order to mend the fabric of what land still remained, we entrusted six leaders with six precious archstones. One to the king of a small yet industrious land. One to the king of the burrowers underground. One to the wise queen of the great ivory tower. One to the chieftain of lost and ill-fortuned souls. One to the shaman of the tempest-worshipping shadowman. And the last to the great giants of the northern lands. The archstones were placed in the fringelands that survived. We contained the old one here below the nexus and prohibited the soul arts. Finally, we became monumentals, half living sentinels of the fabric of reality. Alas, the other monumentals have perished, and only I remain. By the power of the monumental, the four sealed arch stones have been unlocked. So basically what that means is you can go other places besides Boletaria now. Now you must lull the old one back to its slumber and seal it away for all eternity. If not, the deep fog will absorb all that we know. Have you the strength to bear this burden? Uh, yes? Yes. We are fortunate indeed to have you. Now, go forth and destroy every last demon. The old one, without demons to feed its souls, will a new servant seek and lure you to its bosom. Okay. If you say no, you you mean you have to say yes to that. So. We neutralize the old one and ban the soul of however the monument. Alright, he, he said the same thing there pretty much. 
You mentioned King Awant, who is the king of Boletaria. Uh, we'll uh, meet him later. Um, I don't want to kill myself just yet. Let's level up first. And then uh, we can go... See, I don't know what weapon I'm looking for. I, wa I want the Claymore, but I have no idea where it's at. <laughs> so we're going to rock the Bastard Sword for right now. Um, so we just need to make sure we get the stats to wield it correctly, which are... Uh, what are they? That's why am I not seeing this? 18 strength. So we need four points in strength, I think. Eye stones briefly connect diffused worlds. Should you lose your physical form, remember the eye stone. That's your multiplayer mechanics. The maiden in black manipulates soul within human prowess. Her strength allows her to aid slayers of demons. In other words, level up here. Seek us out the power of souls? Yes. Of course. After all, thou requirest strength. Go ahead. Touch the demon inside me. Let these vagabond souls become thine own. Seek soul power. Everything is going into strength. All right, confirm strength build activated. Let strength art thou finished. Uh. May thy strength help the world be mended. There we go. Got some one-handed bastard sword action. Uh, what's the next level up cost? 1039. Alright. Uh, we have... We have things. Hold on. Um, inventory. We have soul items. How much does one of these give us? 400. Was it... How much was it? put one into to vitality as well just for the the fun of it so we could go to the next area of boletaria or we could go through the first area of the mine um i think we'll we'll stick with boletaria right now i'm confident in this next boss fight more so than the other one so and i don't remember this being super hard to get fuck hold on we need to go back to soul form before we do this. I almost forgot already. I don't want to uh, mess with that world tendency right now. So we need to go over here and jump off a ledge. <laughs> I don't think this is high enough. We have to go up another floor. Hold on, maybe this will work. There we go. Yeah, this is a big thing you can mess up if you don't know. Make sure you stay in soul form uh, as you go through the different areas in Demon Souls. Unless you don't care about world tendency, um, that could end up very badly for you, though, if you don't manage it. Because red phantoms start to appear and shit in, in, uh, whenever you go towards the black world tendency side of things. And if you're having a hard time already, it just makes it harder. So. I think there's some items down here too. Hold on. Uh, hello. I have sinned. I'm sorry. I swore allegiance to Saint Abain, but was of no use to him. And now, I have run away and abandoned his augustness. Augustness. Oh, this is the Umbasa guy. Oh Lord, punish me, for I have not the strength to. Punish myself. Oh, August one, I hesitate to imagine your present state deep within the darkness. Will you continue to pray? Okay. 
Oh, Augusti. Will you continue to pray? Oh, what's up, dude? Oh, you must be another disciple of God. <laughs> I guess. You am on a quest to fight the demons in the name of the Lord. May I share God's power with you? Do not be bashful. We are both cut from the same. Yeah, can I get those gauntlets, bro? Or we can learn heal here. A miracle is a heavenly act, but spells are the acts of demons, the work of soul arts. They have similar effects, and yet one is clearly evil, and the other is clearly good. Magicians, in the end, are mere servants of the demons. So about those bracers you got. I see. You wish to train yourself in stoicism. Very well. I pray we meet again. Okay. What up, girl? Oh my. How has this happened? I don't know. Has God abandoned us for King Alant? Failing to show proper respect? Oh, Mbasa. Oh, Mbasa. I don't remember who these people are, but okay. Back in the time that I lived below Bonataria Castle, King Alant left on some strange business, then returned with horrible demons in tow. Soon, the land was ravaged by soul-starved madmen. My spine shudders just to think about it. If I did not have my miracle stone shard, keepsake of my grandfather, I may not have survived. I have it. All that armor and God still doesn't love them. <laughs> God. Uh, is there another man over here? There is. This is the magic guy, I think. What do you want, brute? Hey. I have no use for Adelpage like yourself. Away with you. Our uh, intelligence is not high enough to talk to him, apparently. Sorry. What's up, crestfallen? <laughs> gone and died have you if you die here in Volataria, your soul will return to this temple well what will you do next give up that's what i did i think i just lost my nerve for this kind of thing uh we're not giving up just yet All right, that's the original way. We're going this way. I think there's phalanx demons. There they are. Mini, mini phalanx demons, I guess you'd call them. Okay, boys. Calm down with your spears. Oh, we probably could have upgraded this sword. Oh shit. Ah. I'm gonna bash you to death. Is there anything over there? There is. You know what? We should have um, sent our shit to the stock. Sent our upgrade mats to the stockpile, Thomas. We don't need to carry those with us. Hello, you Thunder. over here. What did you do? It's me, Ostrava. Stuck again? Look at me. Fenced in by enemies. Oh God. Could you assist me one last time? I mean, sure. Clear out the soldiers blocking this passage, if it please you. The Lord's path. Just over there is now a feeding ground for dragons. Have your wits about you. Uh, I mean, that's a good tip to know that. 
Um, we're gonna deal with the fire breathing red dragon. The uh, it all it uh, like in, like scorching the paths the whole way through this area. So you just gotta sprint for your life up here. Don't stop for the items. Don't stop for the items, even though you want to. And you still don't make it. We should let him pass once, then run as he's burning in front of us. And that's why you don't come here, human. Excuse me, guys. I'm not fighting all of you again. There is no reason for that. That was really loud. Oh god, no. I went too far, I think. Oh, that was close. Okay, we're done with that. Uh, let's go up here. So, there's actually something we're gonna do. Maybe not right now, though. I'll come back later and do it. I'll show you. So you can actually sit right here with a bow and as he comes down each time, just shoot him with an arrow and uh, repeat that process long enough and he'll die and you'll get his soul and then you don't have to worry about, you know, the path being lit on fire in front of you constantly. <laughs> Hey. That's not very nice. Gash? That's probably for, probably, uh, for bleed. Hey. Oh, blue eyed knight curious. That's cool. All right, we saved you, buddy. Thank you. That's twice now. Don't get yourself killed. Time to forge ahead. This is a token of my gratitude. Please accept it. Dark moon grass. We're definitely not going to be using that. How much heavier is that? Oh, we're wearing this now. Aesthetically, it looks better. Kind of bulky without a helmet on. Our head looks kind of tiny, but it's okay. I want to say there's some dogs up here we have to fight. Whoa, I see you back there, buddy. Hey. I want to parry you. 
What does this look like? Oh. Okay. Oh, it's not over yet. So brutal. Fucking dogs and souls games, man. That went surprisingly well. That can go very bad very quickly. What are you aiming at, dude? Hey, buddy. Ah, oh, we meet again. Fancy that. Hope you find something that suits you. Oh, you have the Claymore. Okay. Well, I, I want to buy that from you. Not right now. I'll come back for it. What are the stats requirements? 20 strength. That's it, huh? Okay. Well, I'll be back. Hard times, eh? I'm sure you'll turn things around. Don't move. I'll be back. <laughs> the bosses in Tales of Vesperia are super tough. Dude, based off that one we fought yesterday, I would agree on, on that with that statement. What the fuck hit me? Oh. What's up, boys? We'll come back for those souls later. Contacts are getting a little dry. Oh, we had iframes or we would have died right there. Come on, come on back. I think this is the safe spot right here. I don't think Red Bull's gonna moisten my eyes. <laughs> oh wait, hold on a second. I mean, you can go ahead and do what you're gonna do. I'm gonna kill the guys up here real quick. I mean, it, that would solve the problem, but I took my contact out. I don't disagree with that statement. All right, we wanna make sure we have the stats to use the bow. They are 18 and 10, so we're good. So we'll just buy like a fuck ton of arrows, like normal arrows you can buy back at the Nexus and fight him right here. I think you can fight him right here. Yep. Sadly, you can't really hit him with your sword when he's coming across like that. That would be cool though. Want this don't kill me uh. I'm being greedy now all right get out get out get out get out get out let's do this
All right, we're almost to it. There's a boss through there. We're not going to do it just yet. Let's, uh, this door opens up. I don't know where you get the key at, though. Oh, no, don't leave, don't leave. Ah, fuck. I need to remember to get that guy again. Actually, we'll try the old restart trick here after I kill these guys. I don't know if it works in Demon Souls or not. Noble lo Noble's Lotus. Okay. I don't know what that does. All right, so we want to do not that button. Save and exit game. Continue. And the uh, the crystal lizard should be back, I think. If it works the same way. As it does in the other Souls games. Um, I don't think it does. Okay. It might require you to, to leave the area completely then. Well, I'm not doing that right now. We're going to go fight this boss. Yeah. So the key with this fight is to not fight the boss right away. Go kill all the archers first. And also don't get hit by that like magic attack he's doing while you're killing the archers. You can kick them off the sides, RP, like push them off the sides, but it won't kill them. And neither will he. He won't kill them either because they're on the same side. <laughs> This is also uh, the OG, the one reborn fight from Bloodborne. Because you also have to, in that fight, go around and kill a bunch of guys before you fight the one reborn. And he also tries to hit you while you're running around and doing it. From, so this is like where that, that the uh, inspiration for that came from. Good old iframes. That was close. All right, let's go smack his ankles. Ow. Alright, I think that one's good. That's not the ideal position for him. That looked really cool, though. Can you come over here a little bit? I'm not dead. Oh no, wrong button. I'm dead. I fucked it up. <laughs> uh, what an easy fight that I screwed up.
I thought I had my heels on. I had the pine resin on. Duh. Now we have a long run back. But we can also try to get the crystal lizard again now. So silver linings, right? <laughs> Come on, Mr. Dragon. I broke your boards. Oh, okay. I think he's hitting me with his claws, not the fire. Thank you. I come on back. Come on back. Let's get back over there now. Don't choke. Almost fucked that up. Oh no, I'm gonna die. I said they drop their weapon or shield or anything. I don't think they do. Bunch of healing items though right there. Um, alright, lizard time. Then uh power knight round two. Don't keep the pine resin on after we use it the first time. <laughs> Sorry little buddy. I need your oh, I need your minerals! Here we go.
so far so good oh my god that was really close actually some oil. Oh, that's not good. I was not even near you, sir. Oh, there's a circle that comes out around. I see now. Okay. No! Come on, game! Oh, wait. I can still get his head. Whoa, it's like jiggle mechanics. Oh! Alright, I need you to move, dude. Come on, let's get over here. He looks like a badass, though. Tower night down. Woo. So, if you guys were wondering, each like arch stone has three layers to it. So this is layer two. Um, we can't proceed through layer three just yet. <clears throat> they want you to go do other stuff first. So we have to come back here later, later to do the third part. Which we are nowhere near strong enough to do that anyway, so that's kind of good they don't let you go there. Because you'd find out real quick that, hey, I should probably turn around. I don't think the Blue Knight armor was in the original game. You thought, you thought this was a speedrun? First you thought it was a no-hit run RP, then you thought it was a speedrun. What are you talking about, bro? Very confused. Hey. Thou seekest the power of the soul, no? I'm pretty sure I said this is going to be just a for fun, enjoy the game run when we first started. You enjoy watching speedruns, though? Uh, I, I don't enjoy doing speedruns, though. That's, like, never been my thing. Like, I, I also enjoy watching them a lot. Um, doing them, I don't know if I would have fun doing that. We're gonna go fucking... 
Support human. Um, hold on. Thankfully, the game has faster load times than the PS3 did back in the day. Um, we're going to go and see if we can get 6,000 souls with our soul item. We probably will get enough on the way there. So I want to also talk to you. That ornament means she didn't make it after all. Oh. My dearest we picked that up in the beginning of Boletaria. May she rest in peace. May I ask a favor? Would you mind giving me that hair ornament? I'd like to have it in memory of my daughter. That you left. And then the clothes we found with that, I'm pretty sure were his wife were his wife's clothes. You're a saint. Thank you. Thank you so much. I mustn't forget. It's not much, but please accept this as thanks. I found it discarded on the main road. It might look ordinary, but anyway. I feel that you should have it. It will be happier in your hands. Oh, what does this do? Hold on. Oh, item capacity. Okay, item capacity. That's that's good to have. Um. I would be happy to lighten your load. So let's organize our storage. Where's the rocks? Let's uh, deposit our rocks. Oh shit! Our item burden was almost full too. Uh, we don't need the broadsword, we don't need the scimitar, the mail break of the spear, or the winged spear. Catalyst. Bolt. Don't need this stuff. Don't need that. Don't need that. Keep the, the rings can't be that heavy, right? Not really. I mean, I guess we don't need to have them with us anyway. Then I know grass is heavy. Right? Oh, yeah, it is. Makes no sense, but it's heavy. What does this do? Oh, counteracts poison, stops bleeding. That with us. Rest assured, your goods are safe and sound with me. Best of luck to you. All right, let's go kill ourselves real quick. <laughs> and then uh, go, I want to go buy the claymore. All right, that wasn't the goal. I need you to die. Maybe I need to get up higher. Oh, this is probably good right here. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> now, the only annoying part is we have to run back up there to get our souls. Oh, wait, is that Ostrava right there? Let's go talk to him real quick. and his subjects were modest and plain but also steadfast and compassionate I have spent much time in my studies in the cultured countries of the south yet no country holds my heart as does Boletaria but look at what has become of us now I refuse to believe that this is what father wished for our great land Here in Boletaria, we speak of the legend of the two swords and the solitary hero. The two swords are Demonbrand and Soulbrand. One sword banishes that which befouls man, and the other banishes man himself. The solitary hero is old King Doran. 
King Doran is the Everlasting One, founder of Boletaria and protector of the Two Swords. <laughs> of course, only according to legend. But in the dark state of our land, sometimes legends are all we have. King Alant led Boletaria with a getting all the lore in, bravest knights, learning about Boletaria, the noble twin fangs, Valapax and Bjorn. Alfred, the Tower Knight, Metas, the Penetrator, and the brave tribesman Longbow Ulan, and his fearsome legions. But today, Boletaria is an abysmal mess. We just killed Alfred. Valifax was lost, and Bjorn slipped through the fissure, never to be heard from again. All the rest, along with Boletaria, are either devoured by the fog or fallen afoul of the demons. Boletarian knights are no longer. But perhaps our age will see the rise of new heroes. Such as yourself. That was cool. I didn't realize that the uh, the Tower Knight and the uh, Penetrator, who we'll meet later, were actually characters, quote-unquote, in the story. But perhaps our age... That's cool. Alright. Let's grab those souls real quick. Why I go back up? Yeah, so we just defeated Alfred, the Tower Knight. We will not fight Metis, the, the Penetrator, for a while, though. Like, actually, probably a long while. All right, so we need to collect about, a, what is that, like 800 souls on the way there? 860 souls? Glancing blow. Just keep running, just keep running. All right, let's go down here and uh, get to the merchant again. Uh, so the crescent moon grass, half moon grass, and we have we have a uh, late moon grass and full moon grass. Those are all uh, healing items in the game. So you eat grass to heal yourself. Yeah. Essentially RP. Alright. So I want to use All right. 
I would like to purchase your claymore. Thank you. Thanks for that. No problem. Thank you. That's a big ass sword comparatively to what we just had. I think it's the same move set. Yeah, she definitely thick. <laughs> She's too thick. Oh no! <laughs> All right, good night, RP. Actually, I think with that, that is gonna about wrap up for the uh, the uh, stream for tonight. That was a lot of fun, actually, like hopping into Demon Souls. I was hoping we'd get to do that tonight. So tomorrow, um, I don't normally stream on Wednesdays, but at around four o'clock tomorrow, I'll be going live till about I don't know. I want to go till like nine, I think. So it'll be a little earlier than usual, and we'll end a little earlier, but it's still like a bonus stream. Um, so yeah, we'll all be playing Demon Souls all, uh, for most of tomorrow, <laughs> then I guess. So, uh, if that interests you guys, make sure you stop back then, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Good night.